If your gas water heater is not heating, here are the top five most probable causes. Carbon deposits can create a restriction in the pilot, preventing it from lighting the gas burner. You can try cleaning the pilot with a stiff brush or compressed air, but the pilot may need to be replaced with a new one. The igniter, or spark electrode, is the component that lights the pilot. A defective igniter, or electrode, will stall the ignition process and prevent the water from heating. You can test the igniter for continuity to determine if there is a continuous electrical path present. If there's no continuity, the igniter has failed and will need to be replaced. The gas valve opens to allow gas to enter the burner and be lit by the igniter. A faulty gas valve may prevent gas from entering the burner. You should first confirm that the ignition source is working properly and the gas valve has pressure before replacing the valve assembly. Most gas water heaters will use either a thermal couple or a thermal pile to monitor the pilot. If the pilot goes out, the thermal couple or thermal pile will prevent the gas valve from opening. A defective thermocouple or thermopile may prevent the pilot from staying lit. On some water heaters, a draft inducer fan motor draws air into the burner area, causing the pressure switch to close, signaling the control board to continue the ignition process. A malfunctioning pressure switch may fail to close even with adequate airflow. Again, you can use a multimeter to test the switch for continuity, provided the switch is connected to the water heater and the draft inducer fan motor is running. All of the parts shown in this video are available on our website. Be sure to enter the full model number of your product to find the specific replacement part that will fix your water heater.